Welcome to the Midship Detective Agency. Which case would you like to solve? Please choose one now. Welcome, detectives. This is a big case. Let's check in with Mickey. Don't worry, we'll get right on it. Oh boy, am I glad you're here. Because we've got one doozy of a case. You just won't believe it, but... <laughs> Paintings are being stolen right here on the ship. <laughs> yeah, Goofy, I know. Are there any suspects? Seven of them. And the ship's really big. Well, I think we're going to need some help. <laughs> no problem. Check out our new detectives. They're going to help us crack this case. Uh -huh. I just know it. <laughs> detectives, we need to catch that criminal and find those stolen paintings. And that means you're gonna have to search all around the ship. Susan, our detective trainer, will teach you how. You will use a high-tech detective badge. This is an amazing all-in-one tool that you'll use to solve the case. Your team will share one badge. To use it, you will need to face the black and white pattern toward the center of the screen while holding it from the bottom. Make sure your fingers don't cover the pattern. And keep the badge straight up and down. You will also need to stand on the mark. First, we'll need to activate your badge. Pick up one badge and stand on the mark. Now, hold up your badge with the black and white pattern facing the screen. Remember four things. Well done. Now move your badge until it matches exactly with the outline. Good job. This badge number is now registered to your team. Now, let's practice. Move the magnifying glass until you find the key. Great work! Your badge can be used in different ways. You might need to rotate something slowly. Or, some things might need to be pushed. And if it starts to look like this, and you hear this noise, it means your badge isn't straight up and down. So make sure you're holding it correctly. We will be giving you a case book. It contains a collection of our top suspects with information on each one. Read this over carefully. When you uncover clues, write them down so you can cross off suspects as you go. When only one is left, that suspect must be our criminal. The casebook also has a map where witnesses have reported suspicious activity. At each place, you'll find a piece of art. Hold up your badge toward the art and a secret place will be revealed. Search carefully for clues or stolen paintings. Go ahead and pick up your pencil and the casebook with a blue label. Start your search at this location. Go there now. They're all set, Mickey. Well, that about does it. You've got everything you need to crack this case and find those missing paintings. Good luck!
hold your badge a little farther back from the artwork. Hmm, I wonder if the suspect has been here. Use your night scope to see if there's a clue. like a scorecard for mini golf. This must be a clue. The names are smudged, but look at that. Every name has the letter A in it. So that means a criminal must have a letter A in their name. Check your casebook. Why don't you write that down? Check the pictures and read the descriptions in your casebook to see who you can cross off. Now it's up to you, detectives. Go to any painting on your map and continue searching. Hmm, maybe there's something behind that panel. I know, use your power screwdriver to find out. Time to lie down on the job. There's more missing art, and finding this one means we're on the criminal's trail. Come on, let's go. I wonder if there's something in there that could help us. Move your magnifying glass around, and let's take a closer look. List. Keep up the good work. Witnesses say they saw something fishy around here. <laughs> Try leaving the fish out of the way with your finger. It's mustache wax. Great work. Now, how would that narrow down our list? through that steam. Say, you can use your wrench to turn off the leaf. Gorge! <laughs> Go, peel off that wallpaper, would you? Yep. Hey! Whoa! It's you, Goofy! Ooh, nice portion! <laughs> Great job, everybody! That's one more painting! Keep going! Hmm, there's something funny going on here. Someone's been messing with those crates! I 
Bruno, use your laser to burn the ropes, and let's see what's inside. Hmm, what came out of that crate? Look, a potion bottle. That's a clue. Come on, write it down, and keep going. through that window. Good thing you're in squeegee mode. <laughs> you know what to do. Hey, Goofy, is that a painting? <laughs> you found another one. Good job, detectives. You and Goofy sure make a great team. <laughs> Come on, let's look for more. off that window so we can see what's back there. Good work! <laughs> That's you! Whoa! Whoa! Well, at least we found one more painting. Gosh, with all of these paintings we collected, I think we're getting close. Keep going! over the metal objects and search for a clue. Hold your badge straight up and down. A crocodile tooth? Oh, what villain would have a crocodile tooth? Better mark it in your case book. Wow, you sure found a lot of clues. Who do you think committed the crime? On to the next location to identify the criminal. Okay, you've collected lots of clues. Now who do you think committed the crime? Just pick a photo and drag it into the box on the search warrant. Okay, we can check their stateroom. Use the key card and let's see if you're right. Hmm, I don't see any evidence in this villain's room that connects them to the crime. Better check your casebook and try again. Come back and help us anytime. <laughs>